Good day and welcome to a new video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hey oh and welcome to Weekly Tips. We're in Ponsum Sense and your tip yeah. Hey oh, welcome today, I'm Daniel. Uh, this is my YouTube channel, Weekly Tips. I do this every week. Um, and this week, since it's Christmas, uh, we are going to be painting a Christmas ornament. So feel free to get your paintbrushes out, get your Photoshop up and, and paint along and we'll paint this Christmas ornament. So yeah, to start off with, I create a sphere with a selection tool um, and then I paint bucket tool it and paint on top of that using a lock layer. Um, you can see in the left hand corner that I have that layer locked so you can't paint outside the layer. Uh, real simple, I can show you in another video how to kind of set that up um, if you are kind of stuck with that. Um, and then I draw a uh, cylinder shape coming off the ball to create this um, ball, this Christmas ball that I'm painting at the moment. Um, this ornament that I'm creating and I add in some shadows, some lights and darks and start like mixing it and using the mixer paintbrush um, and I just kind of jot down ideas of where the light source is and where the um, shadows will be and things like that and just keep working at it um, do a little bit of a drop shadow on it um, just to make the form look like it's actually on sitting on the ground kind of a thing um, and then you know I edit further add some more light tones to it and once I've got a like a good um, understanding of it um, then you know I can really get tweaky and fix things up um, this whole process took me about half an hour to record um, so that's why it's sped up at the moment you know take a takes about half half an hour I'd say to paint this this image that we've got in front of me here um, but you may take longer you may take less time um, depending on what level you are and things like that you might want to do a bit more play around um, trying to get the material right um, you know I was thinking this is kind of a um, that kind of plasticky metal um, like the kind of cheap um, ornaments that you can get rather than the more expensive kind of glass kind of feeling to it but ornaments they can be made out of certain things so you may want to consider what it's actually made out of maybe your one's actually a proper glass one a really breakable one um, rather than a less cheap one that's less breakable um, so you might want to think about that if it's glass you would have more reflections you'll be able to see you some ornaments you can actually see inside of it and things like that so you want to consider that kind of thing but it's pretty much you know shading a sphere and using that um, as you can see I made the inner part you would have seen me just before like make the inner part of it um, where you know the actual ball um, you know it extrudes out and then it's got the bit on top that locks in to then go on to the tree um, the little part um, if that didn't really make sense skip back and just watch it without voice um, and it'll kind of you know slow it down if you have to and just um, see what I'm actually doing here and things like that um, it's you know really understanding how the ornament works not just you know physically um, yeah you know physically how does it work how does all the pieces look like and fit together um, and taking it apart and being like oh I can draw it without this piece what a, what it would look like without this piece um, here I'm you know fixing up the shading and things like that but yeah I, you can just see me kind of shading this ball and trying to get the um, you know the light source uh, get that in try and make it look good um, I mean at course we used to do ornaments, we used to just sit there and draw heaps of um, Christmas ornaments. Um, so yeah, you know, uh, thanks for joining me, if you did join me, I really do appreciate it, it's awesome to have you guys in. Um, hopefully, you know, you guys do draw your own ornaments, um, feel free to watch the whole thing without voice as well to 
really understand what I'm doing here. Um, I wanted to do, you know, pre-record it and talk over it just to um, kind of give you a bit more than I usually do because if I do it within five minutes, you're only going to get a quick five minute sketch kind of a thing out of me. So that's why if it's pre-recorded, you get a whole half an hour of um, this creation and it looks way better than what I would have done in five minutes. Um, and hopefully that way you will understand a little bit more. Um, so hopefully, you know, one day you'll see more of these. Um, see here, I flatten the whole layers um, to make it easier to apply color to it. So I apply color to it using a color layer over top. And that way, you know, it's all shaded, all everything like that. So it can just go over top with the color. And, um, you know, I can make pretty shapes and, and forms with the color, whatever I want with it. Um, and it won't like change uh, much so you know thanks for joining me if you did join me I really do appreciate it um, what ornaments do you have in your collection if you have any um, do you draw them have you drawn them um, anything like that feel free to comment down below I really would appreciate you if you do you know stick a comment down below thanks for joining me and we'll see you in the next video Goodbye.